This morning, the family of Liam Payne preparing to say their final goodbyes. Sources in Argentina tell ABC News Liam Payne's body will be given to his family to take to his final resting place in his native England. It comes as fans across the globe remember the entertainer who first captivated audiences with his powerful vocals at the young age of 14 on the X Factor stage. Going on to join the hit boy band One Direction and hitting meteoric stardom. You're insecure. Don't know what for. You turn heads when you walk through the door. But as a star rose, so did his struggles with substance abuse and mental health. <laughs> Liam Payne falling to his death from his hotel balcony in Argentina last month. The tragedy sparking an ongoing probe, with police now analyzing security cameras to piece together what happened. Multiple sources with direct knowledge of the investigation telling ABC News those cameras twice show Payne asleep in the lobby, holding a bottle of whiskey, clearly already intoxicated. Payne had long been outspoken about his struggles with substance abuse, posting a video in July of 2023 to his YouTube channel saying he was six months sober after receiving treatment. It's good to be in this position and then, yeah, I definitely don't need those things anymore. The party's over. A special edition of 2020 Tonight examining Payne's years-long battle with addiction and the pressures of fame. When you think about it, like every generation kind of goes through this. Like they have their, their star that, you know, leaves us way too early. Kurt Cobain, you have Chris Farley, Jimi Hendrix, you have Amy Winehouse. It's just sad because you have these fans that they're all left looking for answers that they just may never get. I don't think I've ever met an addict or an alcoholic who, when you've had the drugs taken away, isn't revealed as a really nice person, as somebody who's very gentle and very soft, and Liam was no different to that. Just fragile and who need a bit of help and support. You and me got a whole lot of history. His legions of fans remembering Liam as a vibrant entertainer and the dad of a young son. His voice forever living on. Seems to me that when I die, these words will be written on my stone.